<clears throat> Madam Speaker, <clears throat> you know, I was going to get up and, and talk about three examples of good friends because basic health care was not available. They're no longer with us. And so I decided I wasn't going to say anything because <clears throat> I wasn't sure I could hold it together. So I'm not going to talk about those close friends other than to say, folks, we're talking about life and death here. Truly. And I know it firsthand. But instead, I want to talk to you, and maybe I can <clears throat> do that a little bit clearly if my eyes clear up and I can look at my notes here. I've been in this body for 37 years. And believe me, this is the toughest afternoon I've had. And today, I'm going to be casting probably the most important vote that I have done in my political career. Because I care about people. And I know what needs to be done. And you know, I ask you members to rise above your political party, rise above politics, and do here this afternoon the right thing. Hubert Humphrey was quoted twice, and I happened to mention this quote to the speaker earlier today. But you know, a man without tears is a man without heart, and so I guess I'm up here with tears today. But please, rise above politics do the right thing, and provide the votes necessary to keep this program funded and in place. Thank you.